and then we'll get the hose and spray it like to fake rain which okay, i don't know if yeah. it's gonna work you know in movies when you can tell the rain's fake uh, oh you yeah. can't maybe that's just me <laughs> <laughs> Hey, how's it going? Hope you're having a good day today. I've done a couple of cinemagraphs here and there and I really enjoy doing them. If you don't know what a cinemagraph is, it's pretty much just a cool effect that you can do that's pretty easy to do and it just looks good on Instagram. And if you can make it loop, it's even better. happened is Liam's just come over to my house and he's just said oh yeah so I'm just gonna use your house as a location yeah. didn't even ask me mate did I explain uh, it to you a little bit but I still okay. don't know what's going on <laughs> all right so pretty much see this window here the plan is to make it look like it's raining outside I was thinking about it before because it started raining and I was like oh it's perfect for leaving yeah. video you wouldn't even need the spray no, bottle I know that's what I was thinking as well do you have a hose I know you do because yeah, last time we filmed the video here <laughs> You know, at first I thought this hose was a snake just because of how like brown it is. Only the only hoses I've ever seen are like the green ones. Have you ever seen different colored uh, hoses before? Imagine having a rainbow hose. Imagine that. Imagine a world where there's rainbow hoses. Well. Terry's got a rainbow hose. Do you have a rainbow hose, Terry? No. So the idea is to have you behind this glass area here so you don't get like sprayed by the hose, obviously. Yeah. And then we'll get the hose and spray it like to fake rain, which oh, I don't know yeah. if it's gonna work. You know in movies when you can tell the rain's fake? Uh, oh, you yeah. can't, maybe that's just me. <laughs> How about we start doing it? Let's just do it. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it's right, you no, sit, sit right there. Down. I'm yeah. just like, <laughs> no, you're doing a great job right there. Yeah, Stay there. thanks. How much am I getting paid to just sit here, by the way? 20 bananas an hour. 20, oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> Radiation. <laughs> So I've got my tripod set up here. I've got it set to filming at 50 frames a second. We're going to make sure the tripod's completely still. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to loop it properly. So if I get you to stand behind here. Yep. On the other side. No, like, as in the other side. Oh, yeah, like yeah. The, <laughs> the other side. Because obviously, we don't want Cherry to get wet. So, and then we'll get the hose and like spray it and record. And we'll see what happens. I'm pretty happy with that. I think like there's not much else we can do. Um, we got everything that I wanted. I reckon that's good. What do you guys really think? Cool. I really like that. I like it. Oh yeah. Jesus! Nicole. The real question is, do you like it, Terry? I like it. She yeah. likes it. Do you, right. have, <laughs> do you have any uh, other ideas that you wanted to do, or like, do you reckon that's it? What do you um, think? Um, that's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, what else do you want to try? There's not much we can do. Skip ten. It's like raining. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Cool. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Done. <laughs> Alright, so we've got the, the film here, we've just put it into Premiere Pro and you want to change the sequence settings, go up here and if you can't change them here, just go up to custom and then change it to 1080 by 1920 minus 90. Alright, so now we're just going to find a part where it loops. Alright, here, go to speed and duration then slow it down to 50% because we filmed it in 50 frames a second. Find a start point, alright, and then we're going to try and find a loop point. We'll just cut it here a bit. Let's see if this loops. Nah, that does not loop at all. So you just put a cross dissolve and apparently that works. So for music, we're gonna be using Epidemic Sound, which is where I get all my music from. I'm thinking like a lo-fi sort of chill beat for this one. Alternative hip hop. I want the mood to be, I guess, relaxing. <laughs> That's not too bad. That's good enough. I highly recommend Epidemic Sound. I use it for all of my videos. If you want to get one month free trial, there's a link in the description below. You just go follow that and it gives you a free 30 day trial of Epidemic Sound. So it's good if you want to put like background music into your videos, but also they've got a lot of sound effects. So if I go on to rain. Yeah, this one's nice. It's like rain on an umbrella. So we can just download that. Okay, we'll start it from that beat. Yeah, and then we'll finish it here. That should be right, I don't know. We'll see. Drag it here. Duplicate it. Alright. That works. 
And now we've got to put the sound effect. So we'll drag that clip under here. You don't want the sound effect to be way too prominent. Otherwise it just sounds fake. You want it to be really subtle. So we'll just lower the volume a bit. Yeah. And with. Yeah, I think that's good. You just want it nice and subtle. Now we've just got to create an adjustment layer. Chuck that over here and we'll just color grade the footage. I'll put my LUT on it, which I use for like all my videos. Oh, my LUT's not connected. Mate, this whole video has been a conundrum. All right, the LUT is on this hard drive. The LUT is called Yeah Nah. To be honest, this cinemagraph, like it didn't work out exactly how I wanted it to. Like when I envisioned the idea, I thought it'd be way more moody. At least now that I've done it, I know what we have to do and then for next time we can just improve on that. It's still cool as bro. Yeah. I think you've been looking at it for too long. Maybe. It's always good to just do something first rather than trying to make the first one perfect. Yeah, so yeah. like now I know what, what I can improve for the next one. Make sure you've clicked render at maximum depth uh, I don't really know what these ones are. I think all I do for Instagram is just keep it exactly as it is. Tick um, maximum render quality okay, and that's pretty yeah. much it. So I hope you learned something new in today's video. And if you're thinking about going out and doing a cinemagraph, this can be one idea or if you have any other ideas, make sure, just make sure there's a static object and then some movement in it. But whatever the idea is, you should just go out and do it. And if you do do it, tag me on Instagram at 7th Era because I'd love to see what you come up with. But that's all from me today. As always, don't think, just do.